Ken English, and I'm at Art Miami. It's uh, part of the satellite fairs of Art Basel, Miami Beach. Uh, there's 19 of them. Uh, in the Wynwood area, there's several, and this is perhaps the largest and very unique uh, opportunity here to, to see some uh, different artwork. I'm with uh, Nicholas. Uh, Nicholas, would you just give me your last name so I, I don't mispronounce it? And, and tell me a little bit about the art uh, that you have on display here. My name is Nicholas Metzkova from Terminus Gallery, and we, I'm, I'm here for the 11th time. And now we are very happy they did a great job. They improved everything. So the team of the art fair is uh, all the time in, in improving everything. And we will present uh, the masters of pop art and the best artists from Germany. Also, uh, Sir Tony Gregg and a nice uh, new uh, man who is called Dietrich Klinger from Germany too. You know, I'm going to take a few pictures that will go with this audio, but to tell me uh, about th this big statue or uh, describe it a little bit, and I'll get a few pictures to go along. So Mr. King lives in a mill in the north of Germany, and he works in wood. The prototypes are done in uh, oak wood, and he cuts out with a chainsaw of huge tree pieces, cuts out uh, sculptures, and after these sculptures, he does bronze. And this piece that we see here is done in bronze, and this is number four from six variations that he did recently. Now, obviously, somebody's going to need a special setting for this. What, what type of person would invest, uh, what kind of collector would, would take a, a statue, and where would they put it? Yeah, I'm dreaming about somebody who is grabbing the piece, and he puts it in the, inter, in the intercoastal view, on a little landscape, uh, maybe out of the, or maybe on a nice terrace that uh, this sculpture can see the sea and the intercoast. Maybe this is this type of funny, I would say. Is it a good luck sculpture? Yeah, certainly. He's a good friend. He joins me for, uh, for the art now, and then I'm, I'm a real cry if uh, he loses, uh, if he goes away. But Let's go over and tell me about a couple other uh, pictures or uh, pieces of art that you've got here. This one is the Tony Gregg that I told you. It has wooden sculptures and bronzes too. We bring nice sculptures for the, in, in for the next one. How, how is it carved? I mean, oh, no, it's not carved, it's bronze. This so is bronze shaped? too, yes. Okay. He, first he cuts, similar than, than Mr. Klinger, he, he cuts out the pieces by a out of wood, and then he does the, the addition in bronze. Not like addition, but he does the variations in bronze. Okay. Very similar. Okay, what else do you have here? You have a huge masterpiece, never on the market before, for 15 million. It's by Gerhard Richter. For 15 million? 15 million dollars. This is our masterwork. And nobody had it before. It comes out of a collection of Frieda Burda. Racing collection from Germany. Newspaper owner and he... What makes it a 15 million dollar piece? Yeah, it's... it's, it's, it's it's uh, almost impossible to get a piece like this in small sizes, uh, one million from this, but it's not <laughs> about the, the size, okay. it's about the amazing quality, and it's, it's really important masterwork. And he should become the Picasso of these days, I would say. He's still alive? Yeah, he's still alive in the 80s, and I hope he becomes 90, <laughs> but he's certainly the man, I would say. And where is your gallery? We are based in the center of Munich, from some other place. Yeah, there's, there's a number of German galleries. A lot of Europeans that have come over here. Uh, this is obviously a long trip. It's, it's worth your time and your money to do that? Absolutely, absolutely. We, are, we have so much friends the last years, and they want to see us all the time, and we improve our relationships. Uh, we are happy to come here. It's, it's uh, one important uh, time in the year. We are always looking forward to come here. Well, thank you for your time. Is there anything in, in general that you'd like to share with people? That, I'm going to put this up on the Internet so, you know, maybe people at home would even see it. you want to say hello to them? Yeah, certainly. Well, say said, hello to people in Germany. You can say it in German if you want. Ich grüße alle Freunde, die hier in Miami sind, alle Kunstliebhaber und jeden, der uns auf Besuch ist.